<laughs> Sorry, I was trying to get a, some copyright Christmas music, but then there were ads instead. <laughs> oh, okay. I have... I have, uh, gotten the music. <laughs> Welcome, welcome! Hello, Kihiro! Are you having a good night? I just, I just woke up from a nap. I woke up, uh, very early this morning. Well, er early, very early for me. Four hours earlier than normal for me. Uh, so I, I crashed and I, I needed a little, a little nap. Oh no, I'm sorry to hear that, Kihiro. Oh, well, I hope it gets better, whatever happened. Um, but... But hopefully, hopefully it's it's done with now. Well, hello, hello, Ren! Welcome, welcome! Oh, I was just saying hi. I just woke up from a nap. I feel like everyone uh, here should should expect that I will never be quite on time. <laughs> oh, but I think I finally got uh, my unemployment sorted out, so I may finally be able to collect uh, the benefits that I've been missing out on for the last five months. So that'll be nice. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Okay, gonna gonna give it a couple of more minutes. Just see if anyone else pops on in. Oh, Sleepy Burb is always sleepy. That, there's, there's a reason I put drowsy in the name. <laughs> I knew I knew it was accurate. Also, I have an excuse. Forevermore now. <laughs> Time and Crow are two words that don't work together. It's true. It's true. I am chronically late. Just always late. Uh... I feel like this is, I, it's, I wish I could say I would be better about time, but I know myself and that would be a lie. Fashionably late. There we go. See, Ren, Ren's got the idea. It's not too late. It's just fashionably late. <laughs> Whew, I still have not quite worked. Whew, sorry. I still haven't quite worked out how the slideshow is going to go. I'm thinking it might be better without my face. Uh, wait. I'm thinking it might be easier without my model also on screen. Uh, cause some of the slides are quite full. So I don't, I don't want my head to like be, be in the way. Uh, so I might, uh, just have, have the, uh, slideshow be full screen and you guys and you guys can just look forward to my beautiful holiday model afterwards oh but do you guys have any fun plans for the holidays anything you guys are getting up to i'm not super religious but uh i celebrate christmas in a non-religious sense <laughs> oh no, don't cry alone in work. No, that's not the way to spend the end of the year. Kiki, you don't know. What about your girlfriend? I'm Mitty. Aren't you gonna... Aren't you gonna do anything with her? Oh, nice. Oh, good. Time off around the holidays is just so wonderful. You can kind of take a break and just catch up and relax a little bit. So that's really nice. Oh, well, you guys can do something after she gets back, right? I don't think I could ever travel around this time of year because for one, the end of the year always feels like home time to me. And also I can't imagine how busy it must be. Well, to be fair, next year is only about two weeks away, so... <laughs> so that's not too far off. It'll, it'll be fun. 
Oh, and let let her know I am very grateful for her beautiful art. It's it's so pretty. Oh, Toru has awoken. She has the big, slow, blinky, sleepy eyes. Yeah, this this kind of is my uh, I guess end of year stream. Uh, but I'm hoping to still get a couple more streams in before end of the year. So, uh, so yeah, we'll, we'll keep you company. <sighs> I do, do have some, some plans coming up with the family, but other than that, not too much. No, don't be used to being alone, Kihito. We'll be here with you. Oh no. Oh god. I already dread whatever is about to come next, Kihito. How about what, Kihito? Put me out of my misery. <laughs> oh. I don't want to do a scary Friday. I feel like it'd be different if there was like a scary game I wanted to play. But there's not really. And the only ones I feel like I would want to try uh, are all like multiplayer. Like I think it'd be fun to play like fan... What's it called? Fan... Fantophobia? Or, oh my gosh, I keep seeing Lethal Company everywhere. I would love to play that. Uh, but both of these are seem to be more fun with many people. So, uh, so sadly, I don't know. I did see Silent Hill 2 got a remake. Or not a remake, remaster? Remake? I don't remember. <gasps> oh, I'm so jealous. I want to play Lethal Company. Oh. Maybe I'll see if I can get Panda in on this. See if we... I'll, I'll see what I can make happen, but I uh, am making no promises because it is the end of the year, so I'm sure everyone's going to be very busy. Um, and also I would have to round up a good number of people. Ah, oh, I wish I could just buy a PC key, you know, I wish I could. Oh. Next year, that's one that's one of my goals. I want to save up and buy like a gaming PC so I can actually like run games on my PC. Oh, but you know what, Kihito? I did uh see Final Fantasy 9 on sale for eight dollars today. So guess which Final Fantasy game we're playing next? Also partly because I feel bad that I thought you were teasing me about how much you liked Final Fantasy 9. Uh without realizing you actually did just really like it. <laughs> um, so as apology, that's going to be our next Final Fantasy game. <laughs> but I will see what I can do about... I don't know. Some We'll do something probably on the 29th. What is that? Now I've got your attention. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad. Uh, we do still have to finish 10 first, though, and maybe 10-2. I feel like I've got to wait and see how I feel at the end of 10 before I decide if we're playing 10-2. But I feel like since 10-2 is the only direct sequel to a Final Fantasy game, part of me does kind of want to play it just to, like, get the full experience. But we'll, we'll see. Okay, so the 29th is next Friday. Um, I should maybe be able to spring a stream then. Oh, nice, nice. I have to, like, <laughs> research, because I've never had a gaming PC, because I've always just played console. Uh, no, I have not played any more 10, because that's, like, my stream game right now, so I didn't want to, like, progress any offline. Uh, also, I was so sick of grinding at the end of our last stream that I was like, I need a break from this. It, it was just too much grinding, City. How about you, Ren? Have you gotten any further in your playthrough? Mm -hmm. 
By the way, can you guys hear the music? I hope you can. Uh, I'm very sorry in advance for whenever ads come up. Oh. I want the music to be just uh, loud enough you can hear it, but not louder than me or distracting. Oh, okay. Just barely past me? All right, all right. Not bad. <laughs> all right, Kihito. All right, Kihito. <laughs> All right, well, I think I'm going to go ahead and get started with with our presentation. Uh, so I do think that having me on screen would just like uh, detract in this case. I think it would cover up a lot of parts of the slideshow. <laughs> uh, I think you'd still have to beat Shadow in a fight to the death, Ren. <laughs> Um, but yeah, I think, I think I'm gonna go ahead and get started. All right. Oh god. No, not the ads. This is the problem with playing music on uh, YouTube. <laughs> I feel like they've gotten so much worse with the ads lately, too. No fun at all. All right, let's see if I can... If anyone could convince her, it would be you, Kihiro. I will give you that. Oh, okay. Hold on, we're like halfway there. One, one moment. Oh god. Uh, uh, oh god. Stop. No. Just let me... Eh, eh, eh. Hold on, I want chat still. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> no man can stand in my way, Shadow Hammer. That is the correct response. That is absolutely uh, accurate. <laughs> All right, let me just make that sure. That is the correct response. Oh, God. It's absolutely... Okay. I was trying to see if it was displaying the way I wanted it to. Uh, you have a lot of faith there in Shadow Kihito. I'm just just gonna just gonna say that. <laughs> uh, so well welcome to the year in review. I I have borrowed Kihito's lovely, lovely Christmas gifts. So you may you may be seeing uh some of some of the fan art. The Padoru cuteness. Oh god, I love it so much. So this this is my uh year in, year end review for the lovely murder. Uh I say year end review, but uh I've only been streaming for about four months, so it's really like a you know, like the last four months review. But but you know that sounds so much less fun. So it's the year end review. So we we have played all of the games so many games but also like not enough games like when i look at this i feel like it could be more it could have been more uh but then it would have also been very hard to fit it all on one screen uh and our first stream uh was monster hunter world and i did i did a three-day weekend marathon and that was how i started streaming I think Kido and Jones both actually joined me that exact weekend. You guys have been here with me for so long. Thank you for that. Uh, we have not played all of these as much as some of the others. Uh, like Overcooked and Mario Kart were just um, kind of kind of gaming with friends collab stream, but but still very fun. I feel a little bad. We only played. Star don't starve together once, but then after that once, my computer like failed to load it anymore. So, yeah, you came in really early, Kihito. I was honestly shook that like anyone came, uh, other than like my real life friends who I was like, please come keep me company. It's lonely speaking to myself. 
Uh, any... Oh, yeah. I can't... I'm really glad Monster Hunter World was the first game that I chose to stream, because I think the Monster Hunter series just has a special place in my heart in general. Uh, and then it kind of feels like it's come around full circle since we've been playing that lately too. So starting starting with that and ending with that. Uh, I played Stray all in one sitting. So freaking cute. I loved it. Super adorable. Uh, Kihito and Jones both got their heart broke by Jill in some random kind of one-off Final Fantasy 16 grinding streams. Uh, one of you seem to recover much faster than the other. Oh, I'm so glad, Kiro. And it was so fun having you here. It always is. I know. I know. I give you a hard time for bullying me, but that's just because it's it's all in good love, good bent. <laughs> don't don't mention the J. <laughs> some heart some heartbreak we can never get over. It's okay. I understand. Uh, I do want to actually play, like, all of 16 on stream. It was, at the time, it was kind of just, I was grinding for... I wanted to get 100% of the trophies. Like, I'd never done that in a game before, and I loved 16, so I wanted to do it. And I figured, if I'm going to be playing it anyway, I might as well do it on stream. But I do want to actually show you guys, like, the full story. Uh, it's, it's just a really good game. Like, it has its flaws, obviously. Every game does, to some extent. But... I don't know, I just had so, so much fun. Um, so yeah. Uh, and then we played Little Nightmares, which... Which I think made, made, made me lose my mind a little bit. Uh, but you know what? We did it. And I, I did my best. And we did finish. And I feel like that was the important part. <laughs> I got over the J, but I'm still ill. <laughs> Make sure to tell your girlfriend that so she doesn't uh, worry. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and then I think I feel like we did Untitled Goose Game. Like I think that was another one sitting game. Uh super cute. I I need more games where you're just an adorable absolute menace and the whole goal is to be terrible because that is my kind of game. Uh so that was super fun. And what a like great idea for a puzzle game too. Like it was just very like like, I hadn't quite seen anything like that before, so that was a really fun time. I'm glad I finally got to play that. Uh, and we played Potion Permit. That one actually went on for a while, I think. Uh, I really liked it at first, but there were also quite a few, like, bad glitches. And, like, it was one of those games that got really repetitive kind of really fast. And I didn't like the fact that you couldn't actually marry the people you were romancing. You just had to be a player. So I didn't know about that. But I also really liked the puzzles in that one. Like, it was making potions via, like, Tetris with ingredients. And each ingredient had, like, a different shape. So that was, like, really fun. I really liked all the townspeople. Like, they were very quirky and fun. Um, I think it just needed... Like, I feel like I wasn't actually making that many potions. Like, I wish there'd been a bigger emphasis on the potion making. Uh, but it felt like I was just gathering materials, like, all the time. Um, but, yeah. Other than that, it was, it was a pretty fun time up until, like, the end. Uh, when I wanted to poison the water supply and kill everyone. But, you know, aside from that. <laughs> uh, we played Crisis Core very recently, I think. Uh... That one was interesting. I don't think in recent memory I have ever been so confused by a story. Like, it was trying so hard and it made literally no sense. Uh, but I am glad I have that background going into, like, the next uh, Final Fantasy game coming out in, god, February already, I think? So that's exciting. Accident, huh? <laughs> what accident? Um, but yeah, I think, I feel like Monster Hunter was like really the big stream, streamy game. Um, cause I feel like that's, 
That's how I got Kihiro and Jones and Purim. Uh, my OGs. And I feel like it's kind of the way I've like grown the most, actually. I've noticed whenever I'm playing Monster Hunter is usually when I get the most like new people popping in to like say hi and join us, which is super fun. Uh, so I feel like that's that's like the game that feels representative of this year. And you do, Ren! That's right, you did come in on a Monster Hunter stream. It feels like you've been here so long already that I just didn't even think about when you joined. I guess I thought it was like closer to when we were in Crisis Core territory. Wait, how long ago was that? Oh my god, my sense of time is just like uh, non-existent. <laughs> oh. So yeah, Monster Hunter has just been like my my murder recruiter, I guess. And we did not finish Final Fantasy, but we uh 10, but we started it this year. That's it? It's only been like a week? That doesn't feel real. That just doesn't feel real. <laughs> That day on Potion Permit, Jones and I will never forget that evil laugh. I don't know what you're talking about, Kihito. Me? Evil? Laughing? I don't think so. That doesn't sound right. N none of that sounds right. <laughs> but yeah, these were the games that, that we played this year, aka the last four months. Oh, and then... I, I decided every, every end of year list needs a tier list. I feel really bad that uh, my game of the year, like across any platform, is Final Fantasy 16, but I only did like two random streams of it when I was just grinding. <laughs> oh, thank you, Ren. I still don't know what you're talking about, though. Me? Evil laughing? Ugh, I think Little Nightmares was only fun for you, you and Jones, Kihito. You guys just like seeing me suffer. That I'm convinced that's it. Oh, wait, I just realized my slideshow is, like, kind of cut off a little at the bottom. Ooh. Do I care enough to fix it? I think I care enough to fix it. Wait, hold on. Let, let me... Let me do a thing. Just, just, uh, real quick. Wait. Ooh. Ooh. Can I... Ah! Oh, no more ads! Stop. No, it's not a skippable ad. No, wait, I just wanted the chill lo-fi copyright free music in the background. Okay, it's back. Okay, okay. Let's see if that fixed it. Um Okay. So we played a lot of games, but only only a few could make it on top. That didn't fix it. I am devastated. Confia, Kihito. Confia. <laughs> uh, but yeah, my favorite game of the year was definitely Final Fantasy XVI. Uh, I think it's been a long time since I beat a game and immediately like restarted a new game of it. Like It was just so much fun. Uh, and I am looking forward to playing it a third time sometime in the near future so you guys can actually see the whole story <laughs> instead of the random side quests where I'm stuttering all of the dialogue so that we can just uh, proceed. <laughs> Uh, and number two was Monster Hunter World slash Iceborne. I, I just had so much fun, like, especially because I feel like it's been such a fun way to, like, talk to everyone. Like, I feel like there are very few games as, like, interactive as Monster Hunter World or with people as, like, passionate about it. So it's been so much fun, like, playing this on stream and getting to, like, talk with everyone about it. Like, it's, it was just such a good time. And I feel like it's one of the games I played the most this year. Uh, definitely the most on stream. Uh, and then, oh, I had I had to put Stray as number three. It was just so cute. Like it was it was a short game, but like it was beautiful. I loved your cat. <laughs> like I loved how they got like the cat mannerisms down so well. It was just so cute and a really good time. And like the story was simple, but I feel like that's kind of all I needed from it. Like, I just had a fun time with, like, the concept and the puzzles in general. Like, it was it was just all around pure fun. I don't know. The only downside was I did not think it was a $30 game. Mm, but I didn't pay that much for it. Uh, so, luckily I got it while it was on sale. So that was, like, my one complaint. But 
for like $20, which I think is what I paid. Like it was, it was worth it. It was a really fun game. Uh, I definitely had the least fun time with Little Nightmares. When you get a PC, we will play Monster Hunter Stories 2. Can't you play Monster Hunter Stories 2 on Switch? Because that's what Shadow has it on. And I'm sorry, Kihiro, but I mean... I, I, I gotta go with the version Shadow has. Cause, cause otherwise, how will we do multiplayer? I gotta get, I gotta get her back on stream somehow. Um, but I feel like Little Nightmares was a game I really wanted to like, but it just never kind of came together for me. I found a lot of the gameplay frustrating, and I wanted more of the story. Like things were kind of just happening, and I felt like. I don't know. I just wanted to finish and feel like I understood what happened, but I really didn't. Uh, and I know you guys have said like you have to play the rest of the games, but I feel like a, a game should be able to stand on its own and like have a complete story in and of itself. So I was not quite as excited about this one, but it did have really good vibes and like graphics. Like I thought, like it definitely had the eerie creepiness like down pat uh gnome friends were the best part uh and then it made me really sad so freaking how dare it uh so yeah those those were my game picks of the year uh to be honest i kind of liked all the other games i played so there was only one least best uh because i i had a pretty good time with all the rest of these yeah yeah sorry y'all Sorry. Uh, but, so that that was this year. Uh, and I want, I want to kind of give a little sneak peek about what's to come in 2024. And I, I you know, had to <laughs> put our little Padoru Christmas art back in. Because it's just so cute. Uh, and also, if I'm going to use one, I got to use both. So, yeah. Uh, so... I, I decorated these these slides with my uh, fellow birds. Uh, I thought they should come say hi. Uh, so these are kind of thing, like overarching goals I have for the year that I thought I wanted to try and do. So I wanted to let, let you guys also know that I wanted to try and do them. Uh, the first thing is I really do want to actually stick to my stream schedule. I feel so bad that like, especially a while back, I just kept getting sick and canceling or just like not feeling good like at all. <laughs> I know, Kihito, I know. I want to try. I want to try and be better about sticking to my stream schedule. Rip schedule indeed. Uh, I feel like I have been doing a little bit better lately. Maybe, uh, but I do in general want to get better at that. I make no promises about my timeliness uh, coming to the streams because as I said at the start of this stream, that would just be a lie. I did not poison myself on purpose. I poisoned myself on accident by making poor food decisions and also being a terrible cook. There, there's a difference. There's a difference, Kihiro. <laughs> Come on now. <laughs> But, uh, full disclosure, the stream schedule, so right now it's currently kind of Monday, Wednesday, Friday, but once I start working full time, um, I might change the days depending, because I'm going to be working hybrid, but I don't know which days I'll be in office and which days I'll be like at home. So I'm going to see kind of how that goes. So the schedule might change. I kind of just have to, have to see. Kihito, it was not on purpose. I just, I, 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 I can't, I can't cook. I just can't. It never comes out right, and then I just make myself sick. <laughs> well, but yeah, so I do want to like be better about being consistent to the schedule that I say I'm going to have, uh, and hopefully stop poisoning myself on accident. Uh, my other big goal I want to do, and I don't know if we'll actually finish it next year, but I want to try and do a big chunk of them, is I want to play every Final Fantasy game. Because uh, I 
honestly really love a lot of Square Enix's games. Like, they're so, like, weird and out there sometimes. But, like, I don't know. I feel like I just always have fun with them. And Final Fantasy is one of those series I've always heard so much about, but I really haven't played many of them. So I think it'd be super fun to go through and play every single Final Fantasy game and make my own tier list. Um, and we are absolutely playing uh, Final Fantasy VII Rebirth when it releases, as soon as it releases, because, oh my god, I'm hype. Um, but I have only played 16 all the way through and seven remake but that's only like a third of the original story from what i've heard and i want to actually play like the original final fantasy 7 because that's the one that everyone says is like the greatest final fantasy game so i want to see like the whole story the like the original story uh so the original seven is one i want one of the ones i want to play and start on purpose <laughs> Ah, oh, yes. Yes. <laughs> um, and another thing, I I really want to do, like, more collaborative streams, like, with you guys. Because I had so much fun when we did, like, Monster Hunter, like, multiplayer weekends and Mario Kart. Like, it was just so much fun. Like, I had such a good time. And I want to get, like, involved with you guys some more, like, for games. I kind of have to... Oh, sorry I'm late, but my lady had an outpatient surgery and she just got settled in. Oh no, Jones! I hope your lady's doing okay. I hope it wasn't a serious surgery. And oh, no worries about being late. That is definitely a higher priority. For sure. Oh, well, I hope she's okay. And I hope you're okay too. Uh, but we were just going over... Oh, good. I'm so glad the surgery went well. Oh, good, good, good. I'm sorry. I hope you didn't feel like you had to come tonight. Like, it sounds like you've got a lot going on. Uh, but we were just uh, talking about uh, kind of goals for the next the next year coming up. Uh, <laughs> you may have noticed my first one is to actually stick to my stream schedule, partly so you guys can stop teasing me about it. <laughs> Um, yeah, and I, I think I mentioned before, but I want to play every Final Fantasy game. We have kind of already started that, like, with 10. Uh, we have to finish 10, and I don't know if we'll play 10 too. I feel like I've got to get to the end of 10 and kind of see how I feel about it. Oh, you missed all the good stuff, Jones. Every single good stuff, you missed it. <laughs> uh, I'm just kidding. Uh, we kind of went over the games I played this past year, and by past year, I mean the past four months since I started streaming. Uh, I, I had my best games of the year, and my least best, and now we're here. So yeah, um, I think I was just saying I want to do, do more collaborative streams with you guys, because it's been so much fun. And Ren was so sweet, they gifted me a PlayStation subscription, so I can do more multiplayer stuff with you guys now. And I'm really looking forward to that. Thank you so much, Ren. It was such a sweet Christmas gift. I do have to look into, like, what games kind of we can all play together. Because I feel like it has to be games where, like, a bunch of people can come in. So I need, I need to look into that more. And you have to figure out a way to have another... Little, little K big Z. <gasps> oh, <laughs> is is that the multiplayer with Monster Hunter? Because we can definitely do that. Because uh, now I have mul well, not exactly yet. Soon, what? Mm, I have have the code for a PlayStation subscription, but I didn't want to activate it until we finish ten so that we can we can kind of make it last as long as possible because i feel like if i start it now but then we don't play monster hunter for another two weeks and that's two weeks less we could have been playing monster hunter uh but that is that is an option now i just think it'd be more like fun to get involved with you guys like the reason i started streaming was because i want to play games with games with friends so i think that i think that'd be fun i have to look into this a little more and see kind of what we can do but i think that'd be a fun time uh, and another thing I wanted to try doing is I really liked our streams like Stray 
an Untitled Goose game where we just played an entire game in like one sitting and it was a day long ish stream. So I kind of want to try more of that where we play more like short games that we can kind of beat in one stream. Like I think that'd be super fun, especially on weekends. <laughs> I do like that it sounded like gangster names. That was very funny. I was so focused at the time on just reading out the code, it like was not even registering that like, ah, uh, th this this sounds interesting. So yeah, those are kind of my overarching goals for the year. And like I said, I don't know that we're gonna be able to play every single Final Fantasy game next year, uh, but I wanna play a good chunk of them and then maybe finish like next next year. Cause I think I think that'd be fun. Like I said, I love Square Enix. I think it'd be really cool to see like the evolution of the games. I probably won't go in order just uh, for various reasons. Part of which is because for some of the games, I think it might be better if I can add like mods to some of them. So I would kind of like to have a PC for those so that. I can actually like stream them and my poor Mac doesn't have to handle it. Um, but the ones I'm going to play on PlayStation are kind of like all over the place. Um, so today I actually just saw Final Fantasy IX and Final Fantasy VIII Remastered were on sale for $8 each. So I got both of those. So those will be two of our next ones. <laughs> Uh, I did promise Kihiro 9 is going to be our next Final Fantasy game because I felt really bad that I misunderstood when he was saying 9 was his favorite game and I thought he was joking. Uh, and also because it was one of the games on sale. So that'll be, that'll be our next one. Uh, so yeah, we'll finish 10. I think we're over halfway through. And then maybe 10 to... And then 9. Uh, and some, probably some Monster Hunter in between. But, but yeah. So that, those are the, the goals. <laughs> we'll, we'll see how well I stick to them. Maybe for 2024's year in review, I can look back at these goals and we can, we can judge how well I did or didn't do them. Uh, and then the non-Final Fantasy games I wanted to play. Uh, because we can't just do Final Fantasy, I guess. <laughs> the moss wine laughter, the karma from pet put downs. That stream was awesome. That was definitely like the most fun I've had in an like, I think that was the most fun stream I did all year. Like, it was just so fun. And the karma from me and Shadow just insulting each other's pets. Like, the timing was just so perfect. It was so good. Oh, although I didn't feel bad that between the two of us, we got two feints for the team and one more would have meant, like, we failed the mission. So I felt a little bad for everyone else who was involved, but I was having such a great time. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that that was a really good stream. Yeah, I'm hoping so. I'm hoping to have a big uh, streaming year ahead of me. Because I feel, I feel like this year was just about, like, kind of getting the hang of things and, like, learning how to stream. Because uh, I had no idea. And if you look at any of my early VODs on YouTube, like, it is very obvious. I don't know anything of, like, how to get the technology to work or... Or any of that. So I want next year to be like bigger. Like I've I've learned things now. And I and I wanna there's just a lot of games I wanna play. So like some of the uh non-Final Fantasy games. Uh I still can't believe I haven't played near Auto Automata yet. Oh, I should also add, these are all games I already own, because they just sounded super fun and they were usually on sale at the time, but I haven't played them yet. So I want to like catch up on my backlog of games I already own and haven't played yet before I go into like getting game recommendations for you guys. Um, although if you guys have short games to recommend so that we can do our uh, game in one stream, I would be up for that. But yeah, so these are some of the games other than Final Fantasy you want to play. Um, yeah. I, I think I mentioned last stream, maybe the stream before, uh, I don't know why, I've been super in the mood to play like a Pokemon game, uh, but I have zero desire to play the Scarlet and Violet DLC, so I got Pokemon Brilliant Pearl, because it was on sale for only $20, 
Listen, I'm, I'm all about the sales. Uh, especially right now. Uh, so that will probably be one of the next coming up games that we'll be playing. I don't know how fun it'll be for you guys to watch, but I'm gonna have a great time because I love Pokemon. <laughs> oh no, you don't have to go back and watch the early streams, Ren, really. They're... They're, they're something. They're something. <laughs> uh, I mean, I do have all my VODs up on YouTube if you ever want to check them out, but the early streams were pretty rough. Uh, especially before I figured out how to, like, balance everything. So, a lot of slideshow-looking streams. Like this. Like our callback. <laughs> yeah, I want to play Hollow Knight! I have, like... So I think I've told you guys this story before, but a while back I had to do a factory reset on my PlayStation 4 and I lost like all of the memory, like all the saves that I had. And the idea of restarting any of the games was just like way too much, so I couldn't do it. So I played the first like few hours of Hollow Knight, but that's about it. So I do actually want to like go back and play it and finish it. Like it's been long enough now that I, I can recover. <laughs> I have recovered. I can face it again. Oh, I didn't know it was your favorite game, Kihiro. I remembered you mentioned you liked it. I didn't realize it was your favorite. I think it's still a someday possibility, Jones. I think that would be fun. How long, how long is To the Moon? Because I feel like that we could start off like our short streams with that if it's something we could do in one sitting. When it comes to short games, I'm absolutely open to recommendations because I haven't played a lot of them. I'm trying to figure out. I have to I have to figure out a way how to like collect like recommendations from you guys because you guys say things in stream and I'm like, oh yeah, that sounds really fun. I need to remember that. And then I don't remember that. Oh, computer only. Okay. Um once I save up for a PC, definitely doable. But I noticed even running, um, what was it? Don't starve together. I, my Mac was having a hard time. So one of my goals is to get a gaming PC next year. So hopefully we can like play more games and have them run more smoothly. But I got save up for that. So it's called a notebook. Yes, let me just stop streaming right in the middle to write this down. <laughs> Especially while I'm in the middle of fighting a monster. <laughs> I mean, I could do that, but I just never think of it. Also, I never have paper and pencil nearby. So that's my bad. But also, I just think it'd be fun to have like some kind of recommendation pool anyway. I just, I just think that'd be fun. Uh, but yeah, I want to play Nier Automata. I've heard great things about it, and it's another Square Enix game, so I feel like it'd be up my alley. Uh, I've heard amazing things about Ace Attorney, and I actually started... Oh, when was it? A while back, I started playing it, and it was really funny. It was, like, a great time, but I just kind of got, like, busy with life, so I ended up, like, getting away from it, and now too much time has passed and I've forgotten. But if I did it for stream, then I'd, you know, have a reason to keep playing it. Ooh, Dragon Quest would be fun. I've never played a Dragon Quest game either. I feel like I'm failing as a Square Enix simp. Uh, but we could definitely add that to the list. Because I feel like that's one of their bigger franchises as well. So the fact that I haven't played one... Uh, feels like a failure on my part, honestly. Oh, and we talked about Hollow Knight. Dishonored is one of uh, Shadow's favorite game series, uh, and I've had it for a long time, so I don't think I will be good at it because it's a stealth game, but I do want to try it. Oh yeah, Skyrim's not on here. Skyrim was supposed to be on here. <laughs> Uh, I don't think I can add it because I'm in play mode. 
Skyrim is actually on the list, Kihito. It did not make it onto this list for some reason, but I've never played Skyrim and I already own it. Um, I've heard everyone say it's a time sink, especially when you first start, which is why I've, I think I've put it off for a very long time. No, Ren, why would you say me playing stealth sounds hilarious? No. I can be a stealthy burb. Really? Really, I promise. Pinky swear. Um, and then the rest of the games... Oh yeah, Red Dead Redemption 2 is also Shadow's like favorite game. Uh, so, wanted to play that one too. And then Star Ocean... Rain World and Tales of Arise just looked and sounded super fun, and they were on sale at the time I bought them, so I was like, yeah, I'll try these. These seem cool. <laughs> uh, so yeah, those are these are kind of the games I want to play next year. Not in any particular order, mind you. I just threw them on there. Also, Skyrim is missing. Uh, so I do not think we're going to play every single Final Fantasy game and all of these games next year. These are just kind of like general idea like these are the things i kind of want to do and if it doesn't happen next year then they'll roll over into 2025 but yeah these are these are the general goals and i think yeah yeah that's it oh thank you for coming to my presentation <laughs> okay let's see how do i do it no, that wasn't the right button wait wait okay Okay, I'm back now. <gasps> thank you, thank you. <laughs> so I hope that was fun. Kind of, kind of looking back at what we did this past year slash four months. I can't believe it's only been four months since I started streaming, and I also can't believe it's already been four months. Like it's so weird how time works because I feel like it's been ages, but it also like no time at all. Uh, but yeah, we, we did a lot this year for only having about four months, and I'm hoping next year we can do even more. I think, I think there'll be a fun year ahead of us. Um, and I did, I did mention, I don't know if you were here for this part, Jones. Uh, so I do want to skip, stick to my streaming schedule, but depending on how things go with the new job, um, it's hybrid. And I don't know yet how many days or which days I will be in office. So I may end up changing the days that I stream. Uh, not that I've been very consistent with that lately anyway, but... Um, so yeah, potentially keep a lookout for stream day changes, but I do, I do want to get better about sticking to the days I say I'm going to stream. Uh, so yeah! That, that concludes the presentation. So now, is everyone ready to Mario Kart? Uh, I, I, I have to plug in, plug in the switch. Hold on, I, I will be right back. Uh, but yeah, now begins the Mario part. Potential stream time change. Um, I'm thinking probably still 6 p.m. EST. Potentially, it might move to 6.30 p.m. It depends, because like if I'm... On the days I'm working from home, I feel like I can finish at 5, make dinner, and still stream at 6. But if it's a day I'm working in the office, I feel like I'll be cutting it a bit closer on time. Because I gotta drive through rush hour, get food, take care of the cats, stuff like that. Um... So we will see, but it is going to stay around the same time. It just might have to be like a little bit later. Hoping to still stick to 6 p.m. though. But I'm going to be right back as I plug in... Just for shadow and eat cookies. I mean, you say that as if this is not already my daily life, Jones. It's either I eat a granola bar or I make myself sick with food poisoning. I'm, it feels like there's no in-between. <laughs>
We're gonna see if I remember how to do this with my Switch. I think it's HDMI 3. <laughs> I may have been playing uh, Rune Factory 3 again. I haven't decided who I want to romance, and it's very difficult. Oh god, another ad. Well, we can turn that off now, actually. That's fine. We don't need, we don't need that. Mario Kart all right. Wait, where's my stuff? Where's all the stuff? Move in, move in chat. I'm gonna, I'm gonna move it over here a little bit. Uh, so this is open to anyone in chat who wants to join in. I do have to figure out how to do that. Uh, maybe right there? I forget where the things are. <laughs> that might move again. We're, we're gonna find out. Uh, as soon as we load. <laughs> Set up a room, a room code? Mm, maybe? Oh, how do we. Hmm. I feel like this is gonna be like random. That's not what I want. Wait, why can't I go back now? No. Stop. Okay, we're, we're gonna try that again. <laughs> Uh, you guys might just have to add me as a friend on Switch. A great ordeal, I know, but... Mario Kart Alrighty. I think if we do it, like, via friends, that should work. Yeah, I might just have to add some friends. So is there anyone other than Ren, because I already have Ren added, who wants to join in? I see I am met with silence. Maybe I can just play a few rounds by myself. Oh, that's so cute. I never did understand kind of the difference between these, all of these. Maybe I should look into it. <laughs> what does I even say? MKTV? The little flower. That you have a very good point, Jones. I feel like Monster Hunter did uh, incredibly well for my follower count. I just I worry about becoming kind of like pigeonholed and feeling like I can only play Monster Hunter. Because if everyone only follows me because of Monster Hunter, and then I want to play other things then I, f I feel like a liar. Like, I, I want to be someone who plays, like, a bunch of different stuff, because that's why I want to start streaming, to play, like, all these games that I've been wanting to play. And I don't want to make a career out of streaming. Like, for me, it's just a fun hobby. So I've been trying to, like, when I was making my goals for next year, I want to balance, like, growing the channel with doing what I want to do, if that makes sense. Um, cause I feel like lately, like, I've just been focused on, like, trying to get more followers and less, like, doing the things I set out to do when I wanted to start streaming. No, you didn't, 
came you came for all the streams. But but I wanna play other games too. Like Mario Kart. Ah, <laughs> oh, I don't know, it's it's just just a hard balance, I think, because I love Monster Hunter, but I don't want it to be the only game I play, and I get bored quickly. So playing Monster Hunter for like a month and like not really anything else was kind of a lot for me. And now like I wanna I wanna do other things. I, I will always come back to Monster Hunter and I always wanna play it, but I feel like I need breaks in between. I don't wanna look back at the end of the year and see that the only game I played was Monster Hunter. <laughs> I don't know if you'll be getting Angie badges. <laughs> that is true about affiliate, though. I mean, well, we'll see how it goes, I think. Because I do still want to grow the channel and get a get a bigger murder, but... Oh, thank you, Ren. Thank you, guys. You always have my back. I know I give you a lot of shit for being bullies, but you guys are the OGs and y'all are so nice. I just, I, I just, I got, I got to balance growing the channel with what I enjoy. And if I'm getting bored of streams, then I feel like that's eventually going to come through. So I want to, I want to mix it up. And we do have uh, a P PlayStation subscription now, so we can do like multiplayer like all the time. So that's going to be really, really fun. I'm also debating, if no one here wants to join me in Mario Kart, should we switch over to 10 instead? <laughs> I love it when the shit giving is a fair trade. If it's unbalanced, then it, then it can feel like dogpiling. Not that you guys don't do that to me when all of you gang up on me all at once. <laughs> hmm, what are we thinking? Do we want to just do Final Fantasy X? Because I want to do like a stream where I played with you guys, but... If you guys don't have Mario Kart or don't want to play it, then... I don't want to make you guys just watch me play solo Mario Kart. Mm, but this is also what I promised. Mm. <laughs> Two verse one verse one. <laughs> maybe we maybe we'll do ten. Mm. I'm just thinking this is going to require redoing the Plugin setup. Okay, I can do this. I, I remember how to do things. Okay, one moment while I set up 10 instead. Oh wait, before that though, look, my, my beautiful, beautiful Rune Factory 3. Oh god, I love this game so much. It's just so good. The characters are amazing. Uh, someday I would like to play that on stream as well. Um, but I'm at the end of my playthrough now, so that wouldn't be nearly as fun. I was thinking about Monster Hunter Mondays, actually. It's funny you should say that. I was trying to think logistically of how that would work if we're playing, like, other games to, like, break it up. It also depends on which days I do end up streaming, because I feel like if I stop streaming Mondays, the alliteration doesn't work as well. But, well, we'll look into it. Because I, I never want to stop playing Monster Hunter, but it does get repetitive, and I'm the type of person who needs, like, something new constantly. So I, I gotta break it up. Doing one day a week would, would be good. Uh, one moment. I need I need to switch uh, from my Switch to PlayStation.
<laughs> Whatever Wednesday and Horror Friday. I don't know about that. I don't know about those last two there, Jones. <laughs> Why are you not working? Um, hello? System? Uh... Why? Oh boy, why is this not working now? No, I thought I was finally done with scuffed streams. Okay, ugh. I don't even know what to troubleshoot. Maybe if I turn it off and turn it back on again. Gonna see if that worked. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Why this? Why no work? No. <gasps> no. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> seconds ago oh oh we got it we got it okay Whew. I was having a heckin fear 